Hey there, everyone. This is Al Calibre and Mario and Sonic. Out of Mario and Sonic. And uh, today we're going to do something maybe silly. I don't know. I was told that the gallery has, like, some form of gameplay element to it. So, we got category. We got trivia about all these things. All right. Let's learn about the Olympics. Oh boy, wait, what? What is going on here? Okay, well, when when does the Olympic flag fly in the Olympic Stadium? I don't know, man. I'm gonna start? What's happening? Memorize the order in which a character speaks, then answer when it's your turn. What? Okay. Uh huh. What, what am I supposed to do? I pressed A. I'm supposed to point. Oh. No, but. I. Uh, all right. This is going pretty good. My turn. Okay. Yeah, that that one pretty good. This is the game, seriously. This is the exact same that just happened. Oh boy. Gonna poke a lady. Making sounds. And then Amy's all like, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. I'm gonna back my hand a little bit. Yeah, that's... You're making it real hard for me here. Uh-huh, 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 all right. Now my score is four. Pop. Huh? Huh? Yeah. Yeah. And then it's just like, it's it's just, it's trivial because it's just... Start on one, and then you move on to the other. And Peach sounds an awful lot like a monkey. Like, I don't know what's up with that. I'm glad that this is happening. You wouldn't believe. And then you switch to Peach. There's a cat. And there's a Sonic. How long does this go for? Yeah, I mean, yeah, you can add as many, ha uh -huh, as much as you want. If you don't switch people at any point. All right, well, here we go. I uh, guess, uh, yes. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, I think it's five oh yes. One, two, three, four, five, and yeah. Hey, wow. Incredible. This is happening. Two, two, one. Oh, that one's a bit harder. So it's like, uh, 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 uh. uh. Yeah, just uh uh. Remember uh. Uh, okay, so it's you, one, two, three, uh, and then it's just Amy until the end of times. I'm listening! So I guess this goes on until I run out of hearts. Alright. Oh. Hmm. This one I might mess up. Uh, uh. And I think it's two of you, then you, and ah, it was two Amy's. I'm finished! I'm dead! So, hey, if you wanna play, now I unlocked the Olympic trivia! The Olympic flag is raised during the opening ceremony and flown from duration of the Olympic Games. It is not lower until the closing ceremony. What if there's a lot of flag death, and so it's always voice memory? Alright, so this is the voice memory game. That's what it looks like, so do, like, do different games have their own thing? Yeah, Count Master! Gonna count some Goombas! So there's no reason to do more than what you need to, because it doesn't unlock things, does it? Yeah, I don't know. Alright, what? Oh, well, I guess we're gonna find out. Alright, what? All right, count master. I'm gonna master counting. I'm gonna be so good at counting. Count using A, and I can go back. Okay. Ready. Count this character. 
fantastic. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, yeah, this is just Mario Party game. Like, literally, isn't it? Alright, can you count this? Oh, this is a different character now, it's Coconut. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Dead. There's seven monkeys hopping on them hunches. In the sprite based color field three, four, five, six. I did it. I have successfully counted the amount of minions on this field. All of these men will die today. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, uh, eight. Alright, I can count numbers. Like, they're all, like, hunched up in groups of four, which is pretty easy to parse for the human eyeball. And since, like, your overflow... Oh, just like at science, this 7 of the 11 looks like? Since your overflow doesn't, like, count for you... Oh, I miscounted somehow. But, like, it doesn't matter, because I kind of want to stop at five. I do it like at science, this 7 of this. Okay, so it's the same number again, <laughs> except instead of a mushroom, it's a monkey. What?! How did I manage to do that? That's embarrassing. Alright, dude, Toy Cat Sang, no, this. Okay, I'm pretty confident it's 10, but at this point, what does my confidence even mean, right? Alright, now I got 5, so um, I'm assuming that there is 20. I'm very good at counting. Uh, you know, like they're doubling up. I think they're like hiding behind each other. Oh, what? I was wrong. I don't believe you, game, but I do not have the authority to question you, so I'm just gonna have to accept that. Whoa, Tug of War was included? That's funny. In as long, as, as forward as 1920. Well, look at that. That's some fun trivia that you can wear inside your shoes. Uh, what about Beijing? I'm gonna learn about Beijing specifically in card game. Alright. Well, there we go. Shuffle. All right, I'm gonna shuffle it up. Measure cards as they shuffle and point at the one card with a different picture. Ready. What? Okay, what does that mean? So, okay, so there's Vector. Yeah, Vector's there. Okay, it's that game. I'm getting busked. Well, you, it's at the same place. That's some bad shuffling. Well, that'll Ready. trap some people, I'm sure. Go. All right. Oh. There's Lu that guy, Gamma. All right, Gamma Zone. Oh, that went pretty fast. Pretty sure it's over here. Yeah, that's Knuckles. Remember that Knuckle is in this game. I legit forgot. Luigi. It's not a real character. All right, over here, over here. Yeah. Oh, uh, you lost me when you did that thing, or maybe you didn't. Okay. Ready? Why are we doing this on a pool table? Hey, there's a Bowser flag. Yeah. Alright, whoa, whoa, uh, mm, wrong. Robot sound. It's the robot dragon. Eh, there we go. I can see how these could get difficult. I'm not going full bean with- Oh, look at that symbol though. Big smiley face. Sampling them, I think, is okay. Well, that was a quick shuffle. But quick shuffle is preferable. Alright, look, I don't know what it is, but I bet it's this one. I bet it's the one that's gonna be right here. I was wrong. What a shock. I bet it's gonna be this one. Oh, hey! Oh, I really like the graphic for uh, Blaze's uh, face there. I thought it looked pretty cool. Is it here? Oh. So I wanted to click on Blaze. See, that's not fair. Like, you give me a choice to click on Blaze or some other idiot, I'm gonna choose Blaze. Like, I feel like there should not be a psychological warfare aspect to Ready? Olympic minigames. And here we get, yeah, Knuckles and Daisy, the two things you need to bring on a picnic. And if you don't, that's okay, but you won't be invited back ever again. Hey, I got the best score. I did it. Now we can learn some, some, something. Bebe, okay, is a gentle and pure girl who is good at water sports. That's the sentence you decide to write. Her design is based on a fish in water. It looks like a bear. Is it just me? 
Like, all the mascots we've been seeing, like, in the background stuff, I always thought they looked like bears. Alright, so, trivia about the Beijing Olympics. Now we're gonna learn about the ancient Olympics by playing whack-a-mole. Oh, don't expect much out of me here. Alright, we're gonna learn how they're gonna learn the name. We swing the Wiimote down hit the Goomba! Oh, you gotta hold- oh, I don't like that. Alright, get 10 more points. Alright, uh, alright, okay. Uh. Oh, you gotta hold it, and- oh, uh, uh, okay. I'm not gonna lie here. This is super awkward, I- I don't know. Uh, this, uh, so like, motion control with 3D polygon in a space and whatnot, like, that makes sense to me. When it's sprites like that, I don't know. There's a level of disconnect I did not expect. The modern Olympic Games take the name from the ancient Olympic Games that were held in Olympia, Greece, where they play the Olympic Games. Incredible. Never would I have known that. I mean, you know, this is destined for kids. I get it. They might not know that. Now it's time to learn about ancient Greece and all what was Zeus was up to. Uh, alright. Play ball. Bound ball. Bound ball. How can you become an Olympic athlete? Uh... It's a very wild and political process. So use the Wii Remote sideways. Sideways? Okay. Uh, alright. And then we do some math. Oh, ooh. This, okay, and then see, that's a Sonic Orb. But then there's a Luigi Orb. Sonic Orb. You need to check your angles, yo. Now the Luigi Orb. Luigi goes Luigi and the Sonic goes and wanna get a new banana bread. Did I do good? I got 20 score. I guess the game is satisfied. I don't know why my stick was troubling like that. Alright, so, to become an Olympic athlete, you need to 1. Be a member of the National Sports Federation in your country. We're not gonna tell you how to do that, though. 2. Meet the performance requirements set by the International Sport Federation advanced to an Olympic qualifying tournament. Again, that's, I, I feel like you're glossing through a few things. 3. Be chosen as a national team member for the Olympic Games and be entered by your national and Olympic committee. You know, just one of those! Uh, it's very simple. And then, yeah, then you just play more sports. So you play harder version of all the mini games. And thus, this was the story of the elves and the gnomes and the animal spirits of the woods who've decided that they want to figure out who was the best. But once things got competitive, things were a little bit heated and people realized they weren't having all that much fun. So in the end, they just kind of decided to wobble about and just kind of muck around and peace was re-established. In conclusion, the moral of the story is that humanity is doomed.